Okay, I, Olivia, am going to tell you something right now that I think you probably already know. There's lots of crazy things in this world. The world is really a screwed up place, honestly, if you think about it. I mean, a few months ago I read in the news that there was a man and he married the corpse of his girlfriend that died and they hadn't been married yet and he and so he he did a wedding got a dress for her and married her dead body and and then on the TV show weird true and freaky have you ever heard of that oh, maybe maybe you haven't maybe you have anyways my friend and I are watching and there was these people and they get surgeries Sometimes like whisker implants, tattoos of scales on their all over their skin to make themselves look like cats, dogs, wolves, bears, tigers, whatever. And sometimes they actually believe that they are that animal. But right now, what I just found on the internet, I think that beats all of these things. Okay, maybe it's not for that bad for your, for you, but for me, uh, this is very, very disturbing. Sorry, the lighting's bad. This is very disturbing, okay? I'm spinning it. I'm getting dizzy. Okay, I want to show you this image. Okay, hold on. Look at it. There's a bunch of cats. There's like too many cats in that cage. They have no room to move and they're about to be slaughtered for meat. And I guess for a lot of people watching this right now, this isn't going to be that. This isn't, they're like, oh, what's the big deal? But this, this is like a knife in my chest because it's like, because I love cats. I mean, if you ask me, what's your my, what's your favorite animal? It's hands down cat. I I own five cats. Uh, oh look, there's one right now. Foxy, say hi. Foxy. Foxy. Oh, you a good kitty. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to wake you up. Um, and I have five cats, and to even think about. Cats being crammed into a cage. I wouldn't even. I, I don't even like putting my cats in a, a cat carrier for ten minutes to take them to the vet. Let alone have ten cats crammed in that cage, crying to get out. And after seeing this, because I have, I won't eat. I, I'm not a vegetarian, but I won't eat anything like that like I won't eat cat meat, dog meat, I won't eat rabbit meat, lamb, anything like that. I won't, I won't eat, um, yeah, then I, I won't eat like, um, anything that is, like, I don't know, and like, no, no cat, no dog, no lamb. No rabbit. Like I'll eat like beef and chicken, turkey. But um, I try to. I kind of try to avoid eating chicken because I have chickens living in my backyard, and I feel like it might be offensive to them. But they'll they'll eat like leftover chicken. And they don't care. But um. But after seeing this, I'm, I'm realizing that, like meat meat hens, you know, they have to go, they have to be in the same kind of conditions a lot of the time as this. It's it's crazy, and I'm actually am really considering becoming a full on vegetarian. I mean, I've tried becoming a vegetarian before. And then something will happen, like I'll be at home and I'll be like, oh, I'm a vegetarian now. 
and then I'll be home alone, I'll be like, oh, okay, I'm going to be a vegetarian now, and then my dad will come home, and he'll have brought me, like, a five-piece chicken tenders, and, um, then I'll be like, oh, and then I'll be like, nope, and then I'll leave it on the counter, and then I'll be like, no, I'm not going to eat, I'm not going to eat it, and, I'll, and then five minutes later, I'll find, oh, shoot, I just, I just ate all five pieces of chicken tenders. There goes my vegetarian thing, but now that I've seen this, and now I can actually think about what the hell that these poor, innocent animals go through. I think... Uh, <laughs> it's tragic, everyone. It's tragic. Oh. I like it when it's higher. It looks better. But it's really sad. I'm not even kidding. Like, I love animals. Here. I want to show you my... Ah, my finger's blocking it. Oh, I don't want to do that. It makes me look like a slut. Okay. I want to show you my case that I just got for my iPhone. It's so cute. It's a bear. I don't know what to name it. It kind of seems weird to name an iPhone case, but it's a bear. I look so stupid right there. Um, and look it. It's a screwdriver in the sky. No, that doesn't make sense. <laughs> uh, what else was I going to say? I think that's pretty much it. But I, I'm just, I mean, it's just really disturbing. I'm probably going to have nightmares now about this. Like, the, all the animals are going to be like, Why did you eat my face off? How could you do this? <laughs> and I'm dead because you ate my meat. And I'll be like, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs>